So Jeff, tell us, why is the train in trouble? Uh, because when many of us come here to actually ride the train, we didn't actually plan to. We came to the park for another reason. We see it's only $2.75, so hey, why not jump on and take a ride? And that's the problem. That walk-up traffic is being railroaded. That sound is unmistakable if you grew up in Winnipeg. It's fun to ride a train. The steam train is making one of its many daily trips through Assiniboine Park. It's fun and it's really neat to like go through the tunnels and stuff. Families have been riding the train since 1964, but now it could be going off the rails for good. I think that would be most unfortunate. It's been around Winnipeg and Assiniboine Park for a long time. Assiniboine Park and the train are both fixtures in the community. Owner-operator Tim Bazunas says ridership is down by more than 50% this summer. I need about 12 people to break even to go around on one trip. I'm now getting sometimes three, four people, two people, one person, and it's not, it's not economically feasible to run it like this. Bazunas says that's because park officials closed the east gate to the zoo in April, opting for the Roblin Boulevard entrance, so people are not seeing the steam train when they arrive. We were just driving through and we almost missed it. Park officials say they changed the entrance to the zoo permanently because of construction and to have the main gate on a busier route. And he wasn't notified of previous to the East Gate closure, so I did. I apologize to him. He should have been notified about that. That's, you know, that's on us. To keep it on the track and packed, signs are being put up to make riders aware. The train is right around the corner. Uh, it is an icon for the park. Uh, we want it to remain. Bazunas is not convinced the signs will solve the problem. I think they'll help a little. I don't think that's the main issue. The main issue is to get that east gate open again. Passengers hope the new signs will keep the train on track. Please welcome soon. And full of steam. A park officials say the signs are just a start. They're going to see how they work. And if more measures are necessary, they will take a look at that in the future. All right, Jeff, is there a deadline? How long can the train run with only 50% ridership? Well, the owner operator who normally wears this hat, I've stolen it from him, says that he thinks he can get through this season, maybe next and push it beyond. But he says if he, this trend keeps up, he will have to take the train and move it to the US. It's actually from the US originally, Pennsylvania, but of course, nobody wants that to happen. So come on and take a ride on the train.